The teams then, Ghana against Switzerland. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Cheers Peter, it's a privilege to be here, it really is. So off we go then. Granit Xhaka. Licksteiner. Barami. Granit Xhaka. Mehmedi. Looking for options. And it's Jamaili. Lobs it in gently. it upfield well that's where he wants it well played he saw that coming uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there yeah and it was a case of, of good awareness too that wasn't quite matched by the, the right weight of pass it only needed just a little bit more behind it and he was through oh what a lovely delivery it deserved better Look, there'll be no complaints at all with quick service like that. It's so difficult to defend when the ball comes in so swiftly. But you can't question the finishing in this instance. I think, though, there's enough grounds for them to keep working at it. Granit Xhaka tries the route one option. Change to the score, nil nil it remains. Looks to dink one in. That maybe gets it away. Who's gonna make this theirs? Licksteiner gets into the right position to intercept. Jamaili spreads it wide. Nick Steiner looking to get on the end of this. Gets good distance on it. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Well, we were unlikely to see a goal then because there were so many players crowding out that danger area. I think something very special was going to be needed. Spoon forward. That's great strength on the ball. Tries to dink it in. And that'll be the final action of the first half. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. The goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. Switzerland clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Deftly done. Good defending, he knew he had to stop it right there. Jamaili. He is effectively being marked out of the game here. Well, he's a, a source of potential trouble, so tight marking just has to be done. Seferovic, good challenge, he just stood firm. Oh, no question, that's a foul. Ghana seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? no well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. Ghana. Have a sub ready to come on. Jamaili. Barami. Thrust towards the front line. Battles to win it back. 
goalkeeper's got good distance on that. Tried to play it through. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. Juru gets it back. Juru did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. And it's Seferovic. Tries a through ball. That is wayward. quickly uh, the ball needed to be better there it's a wasted chance Seferovic he's off on a marauding run and that really should have hit the net well that's an illustration of how good they are on the break I mean all the pace and power needed to go at it with with real vigor then Long and high towards the flank. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Juru. Jamaili. And it's Seferovic. Seferovic floats one over. Seferovic. Defence has got rid of that. Switzerland may think they're going about this in the right way, but not if a series of passes is leading to no end product. They have to add the incision. Aimed long and direct. Jamaili. And that's it. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches.